In this short video, we are going to run through one of the key features of the Kenwood TK3601, which is this little tiny radio here. This feature is one of the ones that is very, very useful if you have existing analog PMR446 radios and you want to add to that and add a digital fleet or several digital fleets. And in this demonstration, we have got a digital radio here and another analog radio. So with your 3601, it can receive analog signals, one, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. And this one is configured up so as on this particular channel, channel one, it also will switch to channel two, which is digital. So if I key up on the digital radio, radio. one, two, one, three, four, three, four, five, and you can hear that you get a little chirp at the beginning of the over on the digital radio, and also the audio is much more punchy. Uh, as well as having better range and all of the other noise immunity features and functions that you get with digital, uh, it automatically switches. So if you look at the radio, the front of the radio, when we have an analog transmission, you'll see it stays on channel one. And when we move to digital, you will see that it chirps and goes to channel 1.2. That covers incoming calls. For outgoing calls, it is just as simple. And the radio itself, if we look on the side of the radio, we have two PTTs. So you have a top PTT and a bottom PTT. And these are configured for default channels that you will transmit on. So it, the default is the channel you have selected on the top PTT, which in this case is analog. One, two, three, four, five, five, four, three, two, one. Uh, transmitting an analog. And the PTT on the bottom, the smaller one, if I push that one, one, two, three, four, five. I am then transmitting on digital. So you can see I'm automatically switching between the two fleets. This makes it very, very quick and easy for me to make calls and receive calls. When a call comes in, I only have to push the main PTT button. It's only when I start a call, I need to push the second one. So if a digital call arrives, one, two, three, four, five, I can then answer that, one, two, three, four, five, with the main PTT button. If we wait until that call finishes, which is a programmable time, just a couple of seconds, and then I call in analog, one, two, three, four, five. When I then answer here, one, two, three, four, five, the radio is transmitting in analog. This is very easy to set up within the radio and allows you to have this either as a bridge to your analog and digital fleet, or if you wish, you can have a complete 3601 fleet, which talks to your analog, existing analog fleet and later on you can add other different digital radios uh, some of which may be able to have this feature and some may not.